Hello everybody, welcome to another series of Poi Chi where we're going to work on line stepping. To begin with, we're going to find a nice line on the ground, in this case the wood grain. I'm going to situate myself right on top of that line, have a nice wide low stance, going to find my, my balance with each major part of my body, my shoulders, my hips, and when I'm ready I'm going to look down my line and very slowly being conscious of my weight shift, shifting onto my front foot, turning my hips with my shoulders always, and now I'm taking a step along that line and every time checking myself. It can be really easy to lean forwards, backwards, or to start to take steps off of your line. So be very slow and methodical with your practice until you can slowly speed it up. Another common thing that happens here is that people start to look down. This is also true of almost all poise spinning. So in this case, to keep our alignment good and our head top suspended from heaven, Lift up your head and keep going right down that line. It'll make things look better, work better, and feel better. This technique is the foundation for what's called circle stepping. Trace an equally divided circle in front of you. Take a step in towards the circle as in an anti-spin pedal and not out as in a spin pedal. If you want to, you can even put some tape on the ground and with a smile, you can slowly take a step towards a second piece of tape, a third piece of tape, and once you get there, look back towards the center and remember where you started and where you're headed slowly taking one step at a time, maintaining your body alignment and the center of your geometry. Keep going around that circle till you reach your beginning again. Now of course, speed it up, but really take your time with this. It can be really confusing and disorienting and you can easily trip yourself if you speed it up too quickly. To tie this all together, grab some poi and slowly apply it. So make sure that you're maintaining your body alignment, the geometry of your circle on the ground, and knowing where you're headed. This could be a great technique to experiment with. Try drawing figure eights on the ground with the circles that you step, even four pedal anti-spins. It's a great way to take up space on stage and to make your body really become involved in the poise spinning. Thank you guys for watching, and this has been another installment in the Poi Chi series. Here are the last things we just did, line stepping and circle stepping. Have fun.